Just wait first and get the message that I have for you in this question. If you look at this, you see that the bases are not the same. Assuming we have common bases here, we can equate the exponents. So, but since we don't have it, the only thing we are going to do now to get our value of x is to divide both sides by this one. Carry this one and divide this one and divide this one. Or carry this one and divide this one and divide this one. Whichever way you want to do it. So let me divide, carry this one and divide each of them. So that if I do that, I have 3 to the power 3x minus 7. 3 to the power 3x minus 7. You know that when anything divides itself, it will give you 1. That means that here, we are going, this one divide this one will give you 1. And what we have here now, you see that this pipe has uh, 3x minus 7. The same thing with 3 as the exponent. So we have common exponents here. Since the exponents are the same, let's just uh, combine them together and raise it to one of the exponents since both of them are the same. Then when we arrive at this point now, you will notice that the base here now is 5 over 3. If we can have the same base here, 5 over 3, we will now equate the exponent. And that's very easy. Let's see what I'll do now. 5 over 3 raised to the power 3x minus 7 is equal to 5 over, 5 over 3 raised to the power what will give us 1. You know that 5 over 3 raised to the power 0 will give us 1. At this point now you can see that the bases are now equal. Since they are equal now the exponents are equal. So that we have 3x minus 7 is equal to 0. And 3x is minus 7 will come here become 7. And x is 7 over 3 which can give us two whole number one over three as our final answer. Thanks for watching and see my next video.